Alright. We are going to look at making a button from cardboard. So we are going to make a model of a relay button. A, a typical relay button is 12 inches. If you can see on the ruler, you have the inch side. So 12 inches, the full length of a normal um, school ruler. All right. So your cardboard is pretty simple. You're going to measure your cardboard in length of 12 inches. All right. However, you are going to roll the cardboard this way. All right. So you want the full 12 inches of the cardboard. Give me a second so I can show you what I'm talking about. All right. Um, so you're going to roll it along the green of the cardboard. So these ridges should be tightly compact, just as you're seeing here. So you will get this. This one is not the length of the button. See, it is short. All right, so I've rolled this one to show you the length of the button, but it should look something like this. Good. Now after you roll it, after you roll it, the only thing you're going to do after is to use the tape to close it. All right, so you just use the tape to wrap around it. Good. So this is what your button, your cardboard button should look like, All right? There. See? So it should be big enough to hold in the person's palm or your palm. But remember, I told you I do not want it any shorter than the 12 inches all right so if I get this this is what it so it is four inches short so therefore this one would be wrong this cannot be used as a button as I said earlier I, I did it this way because I wanted to show you how to roll the cardboard to form a nice sturdy button right because this even though this is of the right length you would have to roll the cardboard so you crush up roll it like this cool Roll it. To get that. See? But it cannot be rolled across these lines. 